everybody, Brad Nessler, along with my partners, Kirk Herbstreet and Lee Corso. The fans have dressed in layers, and we'll see some cold temps for the Arizona Wildcats and the Buffaloes of Colorado. Today, we look to piece together the bowl and championship picture. Arizona has a sensational quarterback on their side who's a true leader. I think his presence on the field gives them a slight advantage. And Lee, I think that's going to be the difference in an extremely close game. OK, you ready for my pick? Look out, sweetheart. I'm taking the wild kick. They'll get the ball here at the 25-yard line. Arizona lines up with three receivers. He drops back. He's going right. Has it to the senior. He ran a good route there and was able to pick up yards underneath the coverage. It's okay to move the ball in small portions because it relaxes the offense and can open things up for the big play. It's second down and four to go. Ball in the 31. From the gun. High snap as he works from the gun. Once and all. Oh, what an interception. And credit the safety with that last interception. He knew exactly where the quarterback was going with the football. It's not always about athletic ability. You've got to be a smart player and know what's going on out there. And that comes from breaking down film of the opposing offense and paying attention all week in practice. This safety was ready for today's game. They'll start this drive at the 32. Colorado in a four-wide set. Sanders drops back on first down with the throw. The senior makes the catch. And they make the stop. Way to look it in. Nice catch. Sure was. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. First and ten. Ball right around midfield. Colorado sets up with four receivers. Sanders to the air on first down. Has it to the senior. Inside the 30. Stoops with a takedown. Wow, nice catch. Way to look it in. Heck of a job by the wide receiver. These guys are moving the ball down the field. It's first and 10. Ball on the 22. They come out in a nickel. Smith runs the counter. It's on the ground. Robert recovers a loose ball. They turn the ball over to the defense with that fumble, and the head coach has got to be upset with his halfback after that one. Any coach would be upset after his running back fumbles. The first thing a running back learns is how to grip and secure the football. Well, hopefully he shakes it off and forgets about it. There's nothing he can do now. Arizona lines up in a shotgun set. They'll throw on first down, and they got it. And the big fella gets a sack. Well, for being such a hog molly, he can move a lot better than I thought. Oh, yeah, Kirk, you didn't call him hog molly when we saw him at the hotel. It's second down and a long ways to go. Ball on the 13-yard line. Yeah. Number seven yeah. lines up in the shotgun. Steps up, short to off. Here he goes. The true freshman has it. And he is drilled. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Yeah, I don't think it's too serious, though, guys. He's a tough athlete. I think we'll see him back in this game. Excellent field position to start the drive. Sanders is back in the gun. Throws this one out to the right. Got it. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. About 12 yards out. Sanders to the air on first down. He's going right. Touchdown, Colorado! Now 
Outstanding play to the wide receiver as he took it the distance. It's almost if the receiver told the defense of that. You think you can cover me? I'll see you in the end zone. Yo. And he tacks on the extra point. Let's take a glance now at the Pontiac Drive Summary. Colorado is ready to kick it away. Number two, back to return. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. Joyner fields it in the end zone. So the offense comes out after their last drive, had the ball end up in the defense's hands by way of a fumble. They'll take over at the 25. The Wildcats set up in the gun. Brings him down. That's a three-yard pickup. It's second down and seven to go. Ball on the 28-yard line. Arizona lines up in a double tight set. Anderson on the inside handoff. They'll bring him down. The running back gets two on the carry. Gain of two on the play. Third and five, ball on the 30. From the gun. Drop back to pass. He steps up, looking. He's going right. Someone got a hand on it. Now it's going to be fourth down. Nice defense. That was picture perfect three and out. Good series for these guys. They line up to punt this one away. Number 19 punts it, and it's a good one. Smith takes it at the 14. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. They'll go to work at the 21. will start the drive at the 21-yard line. First and ten. They come out in a nickel. Bad snap. Wants to get it out on the screen. He's on the run. Young with a takedown. Good play call to pick up the first down. Now that's how you execute the screen pass. Yep, the quarterback dumped it off, and everyone did a good job of blocking up front. Doesn't get much better than that. It's first and ten. Ball on the 35-yard line. The Buffs come out in a shotgun. He drops back. Throws short. And it's caught. Rutherford brings him down. So they execute and move a little closer to the sticks. Yeah, completing those short passes is the key because it lulls the defense to sleep a little bit. Then you can launch one big one downfield for a big game. Second and three coming up. Ball on their own 42. Sanders lines up in the shotgun. Sanders steps back to pass. He's under some heat, and he's going to be sacked. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. Third and 11. Ball on the 34-yard line. Nickel defense. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Throws it to the outside. Someone got a hand on it. That could have been a big play for the defense. Yeah, even though he had a good shot at picking it off, it's still a heck of a play to force the incomplete pass. The Bucs are lining up to punt it away. Number two, back to return. 
It's away, and it's a booming punt. Number two, field at the 18. Sneed lays it on him. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll set up shot at the 21. Arizona comes out in the shotgun. And he's taken down. Pick up of a yard for the tailback. One yard game on the play. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 22. The Wildcat set up in the gun. And they got him for a loss. A loss on that one as he couldn't get past those big linemen. You got that right. They sacrificed their bodies in there and stuffed him. Third and ten. Ball on the 21-yard line. Arizona lines up for the shotgun set. Drops back to pass. Steps up. He's going left. He's right there for the interception. And the defense comes up with another one. Hey, good job by that defense to get the ball back. So they'll start this drive at the 33-yard line. Don't be surprised to see this defensive end wreak havoc back there. They'll throw on first down. Across the middle. It's deflected. Good job there by the defense to get a hand on it. It was, Kirk. But when you're going out for a pass and the ball is in the air, you need to go after it and come down with it. You just can't watch the defender bat it down. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 33-yard line. Colorado comes to the line with three wide. He drops back. And here's a quick throw. The ball is tipped. The pass was knocked down. This defense is very aggressive, and they swarm to the football. They're always making plays to disrupt the passing game. Third and 10. Ball on the 33. Sanders is the impact player, and he's feeling it right now. And it's incomplete. You can't expect to get a good drive when you're unable to complete any passes. That's exactly why this one didn't get him any points. Becker comes in to kick the field goal, and he's going to have to get a leg into this one. It's up. And it sails right on him. No good. They'll take over at the 33-yard line. First and 10. Arizona comes out in the shotgun. He throws it. Complete. He's into the open field. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is a first down. It's first and 10. Ball on the 48-yard line. Throw on first down. Throws down the middle. Got it. Brought down. Way to look it in. Nice catch. Sure was. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. First and ten. Ball on the 35. Seven comes to the line with three wide. He unloads it, and that one's fallen incomplete. He had his wide out, but he couldn't hit him. When he misses, it's usually high, and that's something he's been working very hard with his coach on. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 35-yard line. Arizona lines up in a shotgun set. Back to pass. Look. Throws this one out to the right. That close to being intercepted. That could have easily been a turnover. Yeah, I don't even think the quarterback even saw that guy. Well, he almost saw him running the other direction with the football. 
Third and ten. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. Number seven is back in the gun. Drops back to pass. He steps up. He's looking. Wants to throw outside. And they couldn't hook up on that one. And that one will go down as an incompletion. It's too bad because the wide receiver made a super effort to catch that pass. Yeah, Coach, he's got the ability to come up with that circus catch. I want that kid on my team. The Wildcats come out in the shotgun. They need this pass. Throws it to the outside. And the D answered the call there. And this is huge for them. It's setting up the stage for their offense to take the field and make some big-time plays. They'll go to work at the 35-yard line. From the gun. He drops back, steps up in the pocket. He's going left. Finds his receiver. Colorado calls a timeout. Second down and short. Ball on the 45-yard line. The Buffalo come out showing three wide. Back to pass. Steps up. Looking. Wants to throw outside. It's tipped. The defense needed that one. How about the move here by this cornerback? Great play that time. Getting a hand on the football. Third down. Less than a yard. Ball on the 45. Colorado comes out of the shotgun, makes a move, can't wrap him up. Solomon with a takedown. It's first and ten, ball on the 49-yard line. They line up in the shotgun, drops back to pass, looks. Once and all, going deep. And it's caught. He's all the way. Touchdown. And he just called in his second touchdown catch of the day. The defense needs to put somebody on this guy before he does some serious damage. Getting pressure on the quarterback is also key. You can't let this guy play pitch and catch with his receivers all day. Tacks on the extra point. Time to take a look at the drive summary. It's brought to you by Pontiac. Fuel for the soul. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He hits a booming kick. Number two fields it in the end zone. Their last drive ended when they decided to try for it on fourth down and were turned away by the defense. They'll get the ball here at the 25-yard line. The Wildcats line up with three wide. They'll throw on first down with the throw. Reed brings him down. Arizona takes a timeout. It's second down and five to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Going with the shotgun here. He drops back. Across the middle, got it to his receiver. And down he goes. Arizona calls a timeout. First and 10, ball on their own 46. Nickel defense, they'll throw on first down. Short toss, and it's the senior. And they get a few yards on that little reception. Check it out. He ran a good route on his play. And the timing of the pass was good. And they were able to get a nice game. 
The defense lines up with six DBs. And he stops the clock with a spike. It's third down and two to go. Ball on the 46-yard line. The defense sets up with five defensive linemen. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Thomas with a takedown. They'll be stopped before they reach the first down marker. Now that was some real hard-nosed defense. Way to bring up fourth down, guys. The Wildcats have five receivers on this play. Arizona takes a timeout. And we'll probably see how far he can throw it as it should be the last play before the half. Back to pass. He steps up. He's looking. Hit as he throws. And it's picked off. Here he goes. At the 40. Inside the 30. To the 10. Touchdown, Colorado. the PAT. Some second half adjustments definitely needed in this one. Our score, Colorado 21, Arizona nothing. Arizona will be kicking off to start the second half. Here's the kick. Sanders fields it in the end zone. And now we'll see the offense come out onto the field for their next possession. They'll set up shot at the 25-yard line. At the 25-yard line. First and 10. Single set backfield. Drops back to pass. Looking. Steps up in the pocket. Got it to the senior. Short pass there, and they get a moderate gain. There's nothing wrong with nickel and diamond him down the field. Second and four coming up here. Ball on their own 31. Colorado lines up for the shotgun set. Looks. He goes downtown. He gets another, and this is a big one. Now, that was a good-looking play. The quarterback put it where his receiver could get it, and now they have a first down. What I like is the faith that this quarterback has in his receiver. He's not afraid to throw it downfield. First and 10. Ball on the 29-yard line. And this defensive end is looking to get into that backfield. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. He wants it all going long. They went for the home run, and the wideout came through with a big-time play. Great call here by the offensive coordinator. He knew that he had a chance to get the matchup that he wanted, and he exploited it for a touchdown. And he tacks on the extra point. And now let's take a look at the drive summary brought to you by Pontiac. Come 
Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Number two, back deep to return. And he got all of this one. Great kick. Joyner fields it in the end zone. And now we'll see the offense come out onto the field for their next possession. They'll start this drive at the 25-yard line. Going with the shotgun here. Steps up, throws it to the outside. And it's incomplete. The pressure may have forced the incompletion there. That defense was about to plant him into the ground. He's lucky he even got that ball off. In second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. The Wildcats come out showing three wide. He drops back. Throw. And it's their true freshman. They'll bring him down. He ran a good route there and was able to pick up yards underneath the coverage. It's okay to move the ball in small portions because it relaxes the offense and can open things up for the big play. Third and five. Ball on the 30. Arizona sets up with four receivers. They'll drop him for a loss. The defense punches them off the field after just three plays. That was a short round, Brad. Nothing seems to be working right now. They line up to punt this one away. It's off, and it is a dandy. Smith takes it at the 23. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll go to work at the 37. The Buffalo line up with four wideouts. Looking. This one's thrown deep over the middle. He has him on the fly. Guys, he's just picking the secondary apart. And now they got the defense thinking pass. I could do. Hit him with the run. the PAT. So with less than two to go in the third quarter, our score, Colorado 35, Arizona nothing. Colorado ready to kick this one off. Joyner back to return. And he got all of this one. Great kick. Joyner fields it in the end zone. The defense did a nice job of shutting down this offense the last time they had the ball. The offense was not clicking at all. Let's see if they're back on the same page. They'll get the ball here at the 25-yard line. The Wildcats set up in the gun. the pass. Down the middle. Batted ball. Oh, what an interception. Make that the fourth interception on the day for this defense. I said it before, and I'll say it again. This secondary is one of the best in the United States. No doubt about it. They're very athletic, and they're also well coached. They'll take over at the 42-yard line. First down. Here he goes. No one open, so he's going to run. Sanders on the run. Game of eight on the play. It's second down and two to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. Going with the shotgun here. He breaks free. 
Brought down. And he carried that one for a few yards. You know, when you have a guy that can grab five yards or so consistently, it sure takes some of the pressure off the passing game. First and ten. Ball on the 27. Colorado goes out of the shotgun. Looks. He steps up. Let's it go. He's got it. Touchdown. And that's the second time today these guys have been able to hook up for the score. Boy, he really looks comfortable in that end zone, doesn't he? Tacks on the extra point. Let's take a glance now for Pontiac drive somewhere. Is ready to kick it away. Number two, back deep to return. He kicks it. Joiner fields it in the end zone. Not a very good series for this offense on their last drive as they were forced into a three and out. Boy, oh boy, they had nothing going last time. Yeah, maybe Scooter, you need to get out there and show them what you made of. Somebody get me a helmet quickly. He'll start this drive at the 25 yard line. The defense lines up with six DB. And he's tackled. The quarterback gets a couple on the draw play. It's second down and eight to go. Ball on the 27-yard line. Drops back to pass. He's looking. Pressure coming. Barnes. Lays it on him. I think the offensive line missed a the block there. Somebody did. It was like a jailbreak up front, and the linebacker will get the credit for the sack. Third down and what they didn't want to get in. Ball on the 19-yard line. He drops back. He's rolling right. He's in trouble, and they got him. The quarterback had nowhere to go, and he's brought down for the sack. They've got to do a better job up front with their pass protection. If they don't start picking up everybody, then this quarterback's going to be pretty sore in the morning. That's for sure. As we go to the final quarter of play, this one is almost wrapped up. Our score here, Colorado 42, Arizona nothing. It's away, and it's a booming punt. Smith signals for a fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 36-yard line. They're ready to start another drive, hoping to duplicate the results of the last one, which ended in a touchdown. They'll go to work at the 36. First and 10. So the starting quarterback is done for the day, and we now have the backup in. Rolls right, looking. Here's the long ball, left side. And got him! Touchdown, Colorado! Look at that. For a second there, I could have scored that back at the football. Beautiful play. Yeah, I don't know if it was the offensive coordinator, the head coach, or just the quarterback checking off. But well, my hat goes off to whoever called that. And he hits the PAT. So with less than four minutes to go here in the fourth quarter, our score, Colorado 49, Arizona nothing. Lines up for the kickoff. Colorado Joiner and number two back deep to return. Joyner. Kicks it off. 
And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The offense gets ready to start a new drive as they just couldn't get anything going on their last possession, going three and out. Right. They'll set up shot at the 25. First and 10, ball on the 25-yard line. Arizona lines up in a shotgun set. McLeod drops back on first down. Look, look out. It falls incomplete. That's just a shame. The receiver did his job. He was able to get a step on the defender, but the ball was underthrown. Yeah, but that quarterback better put some water in that hose. So it's second and 10. Ball on the 25-yard line. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket with the throw. And it's the senior. That pass play gets him roughly three yards. Third down and seven. Ball on their own 28. McLeod with three wide receivers. He's hit and got away. And he's drilled. The defense comes up with a stop on third down. Well, for some reason, they thought they'd be able to pick up the first down on the ground. I'm very surprised they didn't try to pass it. The special teams coach sends his punt team out on the field. Number 19 punts it, and it's a good one. Smith takes it at the 16 with the spin. Let's see if this defense has trouble defending the pass again here. If they do, my friend, look out. They're going to give up another touchdown in a hurry. They'll take over at the 22-yard line. Lewis hands it off. A little juke. He spins, and he's taken down. They keep it on the ground, and the halfback gets about seven yards. first down as they try to run that clock down. It's first and 10. Ball on the 32. Second down and eight. Ball on the 34. Nickel defense. Be coming back, folks. Let's check out the penalty. Personal foul. Face mask on the defense. 
15 yards, spot the, the officials got that right. 15 yards for a face mask. Sometimes it's unintentional when you get a handful of face masks. You got to drop your hand real quickly or they'll give you a personal foul every time. It's first and 10, ball on the 50. The Buffs come to the line with their jumbo package. on this one, Coach? I can't say enough about this performance. Colorado played an excellent game out there, dominating on both sides of the ball. they got to feel pretty good after blowing out a team like this. Folks, thanks for tuning in to our game. Our final score, Colorado 49, Arizona nothing. For Lee Corso, Kirk Street, and everyone at EA Sports, I'm Brad Nesson.